Take it away, Sasha. Thank you. If you had a chance, would you change the world? Everything we do and everything we don't do has an effect on the world. So, what can we do about it? We can all make history all the time. Small things make a big difference. We strongly believe that investment in education and culture is the right thing to do for our country to prosper in the future. We think that organizing knowledge sharing events in-house and external is something all of us should do to help our colleagues and the community improve. We could all help young entrepreneurs start their businesses and promote entrepreneurship. It's crucial to involve the community in different kinds of events and give contribution to the protection of the environment. Because the best way to become happier is to make someone else happy. We don't have to sacrifice success and profit to make the world a better place. We can do good without spending too much. We know it is not easy, but we'll continue to follow our dreams. We invite you to join us in these initiatives because together we can do so much more. Together we can change the world. Let me tell you a story about a boy who wanted to go to university after high school, but whose parents couldn't afford to send him to studies. Uh, he was finishing high school education and felt that going to university is the right thing to do. The education in Serbia is free, but you still have to spend money on living, and it, ca it can be quite expensive if the university you're attending is outside your hometown. Uh, this boy decided to follow his dream and start his studies regardless of his financial situation at the time. Uh, when I went to Novi Sad, the university center where I live now, uh, I figured out that I could do part-time jobs while I was studying. Uh, it was not always easy and I hope that nowadays there are no so many students out there who have to follow the same path as I did back in those days. Uh, back then, when I was a student, I met Vladan, who is now my business partner. Uh, we studied together and lived in the same room in a student's dormitory. And although we were uh, doing part-time jobs and, uh, and were in a similar financial situation, uh, we did our best to learn as much as we could, and we started dreaming about founding a company together in the future. And it was a few years after we had started our first company when someone asked us to meet a boy who was the best high school student in his hometown and who wanted to go for higher education but couldn't afford it. Uh, we met the boy and we really liked his personality and his desire to learn and make something of his life. Uh, he also reminded us a bit of the two of us when we were at the same age. Uh, at that time, we had already been running a profitable business, and we instantly made a decision to uh, help the, that boy by giving him a scholarship uh, to cover the cost of his five years of studies. We both uh, strongly believe that investment in education is the right approach for our country to prosper in the future. Uh, giving that boy that scholarship and making him happy had a very positive effect on us as well. It made us feel truly content because we could help someone who obviously had a great potential to make something good with his life. So uh, both my personal experience and the research findings show that uh, a good way to become happier is to make someone else happy. And uh, it's not something that only Vladan and me as the founders of Vega IT are aware of. Uh, many of our colleagues have been having a chance to uh, suggest, organize, and participate in uh, different kinds of events that have a positive effect on the, on the lives of other people. Uh, in other words, uh, as Michael said, uh, these deeds have a positive effect, effect on both sides, on those who feel happy about helping others and on those who are being helped. So I will share with you uh, some more of such activities that we do at Vega IT. 
Uh, as I mentioned earlier, we give scholarship to talented young people uh, whose parents can't afford to pay tuition, uh, but we also help those who can't finish their secondary education because they live in bad conditions. Uh, we support them with the aim to enable them to find a job one day and become independent. Uh, what's interesting is that one of such initiatives, uh, like uh, helping children who live uh, and work on the streets of Novi Sad, uh, is just one of initiatives which were proposed by our colleagues. And uh, financing those children is not the only thing we do. We also uh, go to visit them, meet their parents, and try to motivate them to uh, finish their education, uh, become independent one day, and even support others. Uh, over the last few years, we've organized different kinds of uh, charity events like uh, basketball tournaments, relay races, and similar. Uh, our aim was not only to raise money for the community, but also to uh, inspire, uh, motivate, and involve other IT companies to join us in initiatives alike. Uh, Hackathon Code for Cause was uh, one of events we are very proud of. Uh, we organized uh, the campaign and involved the community in every step of the way. Uh, project ideas were proposed to us, and the community voted for the best ones that we were supposed to develop within 48 hours of coding. At the end of the event, we've made all the projects open source, and we've donated them uh, both uh, uh, to those whose ideas were chosen and to the community to use them. This year, we plan to uh, go uh, beyond our local community and do some projects for uh, the rest of the world as well. Promoting entrepreneurship and helping young entrepreneurs start their business is something that we believe is of considerable importance to everyone. Uh, we've co-founded a few more companies with our colleagues and friends uh, with the idea to help them develop their ideas and anchor their position in the market. And in addition to that, we've also supported several other entrepreneurs, uh, even when we didn't have a stake in their business. We believe that uh, Building strong and successful local companies is the best way to improve the living standard of our community. But it also feels really good when, it can, when we can help someone to prosper. Over, over the last few years, uh, we've joined our clients' initiatives uh, to donate websites, uh, projects in general, and, and money for researches like uh, cancer research, Alzheimer research, and similar. And uh, our, our colleagues didn't even mind doing some of the work through overtime hours because they knew it was for higher goals. And we all felt really good about being able to help. Each of us can suggest a cause to collect money for, and the company would at least double the raised amount. Uh, quite often, we don't stop at uh, raising the money, but also invest some of our free time to help the causes become more successful. We organize different kinds of knowledge sharing events, in-house and externally, uh, with the aim to help our colleagues and the community to improve professionally and personally. We believe that individual development can, can have a significant, significant impact on the overall company success, and sharing knowledge with other professionals from, from other companies uh, has not only a positive impact on the local community, but also on the way the rest of the world perceives Serbia and its IT skills. Uh, we believe that investment in our education and culture is the right approach for our still poor country to prosper in the future. And that's why we always tend to support different kinds of organizations, initiatives, events that uh, promote education and educational achievement. Uh, we also strongly believe that uh, we need to think about sustainability in our everyday activities. And as a consequence, it feels really good when we know that we are giving our small contribution to the protection of environment, which in turn helps to improve the health of our colleagues and the community we live in. And here's the thing, you don't have to sacrifice success and profit to make the world a better place. You can do good without too much spending. 
And uh, as Sir Richard Branson wrote in his book, Like a Virgin, it's not really about choosing social good over profits. It's about social and environmental good becoming the driving forces of capitalism. We will continue to follow our dream of making the world a better place, and we will enjoy the ride. We know that we can't do much alone, but that will not discourage us. And we hope that in the future there will be even more companies who will follow the same path and realize how happy their businesses can be. Thank you. That was cool, Sasha. Um, tell us a little bit about uh, your employees. I know that uh, some of uh, the employees of Vega are here in this room, isn't that true? Yes. There you are. Hey. <laughs> Hi. Hey, why don't you come on stage? Uh, uh, we, didn't, uh, we didn't arrange this, but uh, I'll just ask you one question. I didn't prepare you for it. No, but and my English is probably bad, but... Oh, uh, your English is sexy. <laughs> is it? It is. Well, you can thank just, you. You can just do it. Uh, <laughs> tell me. So what sorry, what, what sorry. Does, does, does this concept of giving mean to you and to your colleagues? Sasha, could you answer that? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> it means the world to us. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. we motivate, we inspire. Um, if we don't feel that we are doing that because it is our goal. Because mm -hmm. we do it because we strongly believe it. And if he does and our other founder does it, mm -hmm. why shouldn't we do it? Yeah, thank you. And what is your name? Maya. Ladies and gentlemen, Maya. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Sasha. That was Maya. Thank you for coming voluntarily on stage. <laughs> Tell us about your dream. What's next? Uh, well, yeah, I've shared some of the things that we do, and we, we plan to continue doing that. As I mentioned, uh, we believe that, that education is very important, especially in our country. So that's something that uh, we will continue to do in the, in the coming period. And also uh, promoting entrepreneurship within the company and outside. That's also something that we uh, pay a lot of attention to. Mm -hmm. uh, and, and what would you like to be remembered for? Yeah, I've never thought about that really. I, I just, yeah. I just. Yeah, but okay. Uh, yeah, let, 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 let's visualize. Let's visualize. Yes. One one day, one sad day, 110 years from mm -hmm. now, when Sasha is not here anymore, and they are going to write the inscription on the tombstone. Here lies Sasha. It says, "He will be missed because." Mm -hmm. How does that sentence yeah. end? Well, yeah, probably related to these two things that I mentioned. So uh, much more educated people in, in country where we're coming from, in Serbia, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, uh, many uh, smaller companies doing great job, enjoying their, their work and, and being happy. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> Sasha Popovic. Thank you.